Oi! Hello, you have all been oid. Consider yourselves oid. So oi, all of you, oi. Happy Tuesday. How are you doing? Do you hear birds chirping? If you hear birds chirping, then I know that the game audio is actually going through. So do you hear annoying bird chirps? You do? Lovely, thank you. Uh, let me scroll up and see who the peeps are who are here first. The early birds, not the ones that are chirping. Early birds today in the chat are... Wow. And it's apparently a point and click to do with this cat sat here in the middle. Uh, and he's chasing magpies and you have to find him a way home or something? I don't know. I'm as new to this as you are, unless any of you has played this before. But it looked intriguing, and also it's apparently got very nice artwork and very nice music. It does look like it's hand-drawn artwork, doesn't it? So I'm hoping that um, it'll be beautiful to look at, if nothing else. I mean, don't expect, you know, amazing gameplay or whatever, but just expect a nice experience, if you like, a visual adventure we shall go on with this cat called Milo. So yeah, let's give it a go! Play! Just three roofs to cross and then I am home. Okay, here comes the magpie. Oh, the magpie pecked his nose. Why are these birds always blocking my way? Smack it! Smack the magpie! Ah, oh, you missed! Go away! I have to get rid of them! Yeah, smack the magpie! You cheeky shit tried to peck your, um, your nose. Mag's life! Hi, Mag's life. The first step home. This is chapter one. Oh, there we are. The heck? What is this thing? Now I have to find my way through the gardens of these weird people. Click on Milo. So you click on him and he moves? Yeah, you click on him and he moves. A game of hide and seek! Okay, now, why isn't the lady seeing him? He's gone round to that side of the fountain. Can I click him again? No. Can I click on this? Oh, the hell? Some objects can be activated by clicking on them. What is this thing? Smaller objects can be dragged and put elsewhere. Put the stone on the fountain. Okay, I can drag this stone. And plop it on the fountain. That stops the water from spurting out. It laid a rock. It did lay a rock. But what the hell is this? This is Mama Rock. Chandroid. Hi, Chandroid. If the music's too loud, tell me, okay? Oh, I can click on this lady. Robot mower. Damn. Like a Roomba? Wow, it's a Roomba for the garden. And it's supposed to do what? Is it supposed to actually cut the grass? Uh, Janko at rommelcot.nl Hanging branches. Dear neighbour, I am writing to ask if you can please prune your maple tree. Branches are hanging over the wall and seeds end up falling into my otherwise tidy garden. If you need to borrow any tools for this or any other yard work, please do not hesitate to ask. Thank you for your understanding and... Yes, they cut the grass. Huh! Amazing, okay. This is such a polite way of saying, Oi! Sort out your fucking tree! It's making my garden a bloody sight! And you cheap ass, if you can't be asked to buy any um, tools, I will lend you some. That's basically what she's saying, isn't it? Alright, so can I can click on this? No, I can't click on that. I can click on her only to bring up the email. Can I click? Ah, now I can click on the cat. Yeah, it's really passive aggressive that email, isn't it? Oh, got it! Got it! Oh, Pulled out a feather, though. Oh, oh, the lady's coming up. Oh. Is she gonna smack the cat? For pulling the feather out of the magpie's tail? You don't know the whole story, lady. That magpie started it! It wasn't our fault! Oh, okay, I'm supposed to do things? Oh. Meow. 
Oh, I thought she was gonna throw us over the wall. <laughs> but actually, it's alright. She's just plopped us there, which is nice of her. The artist, okay. And it pooped! Did it? Oh, that's a nice scene. Okay, so here we are on the wall between the lady writing the passive-aggressive email and this artist chap who's obviously painting something. It's a big fish. It's a giant goldfish. There's a hedgehog. Oh, I clicked on the hedgehog and he's moving. These sunflowers. So incongruous here. Okay, I'm clicking on this fish and he's not really doing very much. Oh, I can click on the dragonflies and that makes them fly faster. Oh, okay, there is a frog here wearing a crown. But my mouse isn't turning into a hand, so there's nothing to click. These are very different gardens. Yeah, there's nothing to click on this one. I can click on this. Oh, that's the frog. Okay, there's nothing to click here either. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay, so we obviously have to find a combo for this lock. For the bike. There's nothing else in here that I can click. Can I open the door? No. Ooh! Someone's been having a nice card game out here with some red wine. Okay, two of hearts. I can't pull any of the cards. I can't pull the wine glass. I can't pull the wine bottle. Can't do anything with this jacket. The only thing I can do is two of hearts. Okay. Happy lurking, Pink and Sleepy! I click on this magpie and he just calls. Oh, I thought I could go in. Um, okay. I can't click on this. Can I click on him? Oh, he just looks up if I click- Oh, what the hell? That's what he's painting? He's painting the sunflower with a girl's face in it? No. Okay. Oh, the hedgehog's here, look. I clicked on him again and he's moving again. Alright, cat, where are you going? This cat sneaking through the the brush. There you go, there's your painting. We've seen the wine bottle, we've seen the frog. I suppose he's holding a brush, but we can't see it. What happens if I click on the cat? Oh, oh, is he gonna eat the fish? A fence! Yes, a fence. What the hell? This bad bird. Bad bird. <laughs> the cat looks so scared. <laughs> what the heck? I can't click on the cat because it just opens this up. Oh. Oh. Okay, that's broken the pain. So now the cat's gonna go through. Oh my god. The cat is wrecking all sorts of things in the shed and the guy didn't even hear it. Okay. Can I open this door now? No. Aha! I see a key! Okay, so there is now a key. The key has got like a little bubble speech thing pointing to the bike? No? Okay, it goes in here. Oh, bad bird! Bad bird! Bad bird has dropped the key into the pond and the fish is trying to eat it. Oh, artist guy is here. Oh, he's got the brush! 
Aha, okay, the brush has got a number 8 on it. So that corresponds with the painting. Brush, and going left to right, so brush is number 8. And then the bottle was 2 of hearts. The brush is number 8. And then the bottle was the 2 of hearts. Okay, how do I get this key? Oh, the magpie left something. Oh, it's the apple. Okay, apple's got number three on it. It wasn't apple the final one? So I'm missing the frog. Okay, so frog and apple. What's the frog then? Is there a number on the frog? April! April! Hoi! Says April. <laughs> hoi, hoi, hoi. How's it going? Are you still at Disney? What are you doing watching Twitch whilst you're at Disney? Go enjoy yourself at the at the theme park and do all the things. Okay, I don't see a number on this frog. The only thing that's unusual about this frog is that there's a hose pipe coming out of him because obviously he's got to be some kind of fountain and that's probably feeding water to him. And the other thing is that he's wearing this crown. This crown has got like six jewels on it. So maybe six? So okay, we had eight for the paintbrush, we had two of hearts for the bottle. Maybe we try six for the frog, and then the apple has got a number three on it. So six, three, right? Oh, it worked! It worked! Okay, so that's opened up the thing. Oh, oh. Okay, the bike's fallen away. Now I can click this. Oh, so I can turn on the tap. Can I click anything else on here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, yeah, so now the frog is spitting water, which is moving the fish. And so I can take this key again. Oh, and now it turns itself. That's a bit freaky. And the cat's out. Okay, the cat's out. The cat's out. Can we click on the cat? No. Oh, we can take the shears. Okay. Oh, we snipped the... F what the hell? We just snipped the fence? <laughs> Um, I don't think we're supposed to do things like that to other people's property, but okay. You're in line, getting rained on. <laughs> oh dear. Wait at 90 minutes. Wait, hang on. Chapter 3, Child's Play. Okay. Wait at 90 minutes and only been on one ride. Another 90 for this ride. Yep, that's how I remember Disney as well. A cat can never resist a box. Okay, the cat has gone into the box. Hi, Dre. Six for the crown? Yes, Bella Tiger. Perfect. Alright, I'm clicking on this cat. And nothing's happening. Cat. Get out. Cat. Okay, no. Damn magpie. Who let the cat out? Woof, woof, woof. Or should it be meow, meow, meow? Ricardo? Also, Rick, 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 Rick. Hi, Rick. I'm gonna click on this kid. <laughs> Oh, it just makes her go to the top of the slide. Okay, I'm gonna click on this kid and it makes him jump. And then we click on this kid and he does the helicopter thing which scares the bird away. Can't click on the frisbee. What happens if I click on him again? Nothing, that's all he can do is send the helicopter up and down. Alright, what about this thing? What is that? I click on it, it moves a little bit. But always in this same pattern. I can't drag it. I don't know what that's for. Can I click on her? She just makes sweeping sounds. Um, okay, now can I click on the cat? No. What the hell else can I click on then? Click on this magpie again. Yes, aha! So now is the lady gonna smack the magpie? No. I don't know, what am I supposed to do? Wait, did I just. Oh, okay, he can. The more I click on him, the higher he jumps.
Oh. This damn magpie is just going to and fro. Yeah, but the bird has gone back to where he was, so I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. And also, what is the point of this girl? Maybe when she's at the top, we can do something? No? no? I'm curious to know what the hell- Oh! Okay. Ah, okay, so you had to make her look up. And then she sees the ball. And then you click on the ball? No. No. Oh, okay. So you start this boy with the helicopter and it rolls this ball. The music in the game is super cozy. Yeah, it is quite nice piano music. Also, hi, Panda. Bummer Dawn? Hi, Bummer Dawn. Uh, oh, I thought this was an ad and was slightly outraged because I subbed. <laughs> no ad. No ad. Okay, so now how do I do anything with this ball? Ah, okay, so keep clicking on this kid. He then comes to the ball and kicks the ball at the cat. Mean kid. Can I click on you again? Yes. And nothing happened. How about you? <laughs> No? Do I have to do it at the same time? No? Okay, you can't do anything else anymore. Bird, what do you do now? Nothing? Cats like balls? Yeah, but... This cat ain't doing anything to this ball. I can't even click on the cat. There's no hand appearing. Over the cat. The frisbee? Nope. No hand on the frisbee either. No hand on this boy either. So it's only this girl, this boy, the old lady, and the magpie that I can click. Nothing else. So the girl, the boy, the old lady, the magpie. Ah, I had to time it. I had to time it so that she she comes down the slide just when the ball is rolling back. Okay, so now the ball has fallen into some kind of water thing, and so has the boy. What is this? Alright, come on cat. Pounce at the magpie. No. Okay. Can't do anything with her. I did click on him, but nothing's happening with him. I can't go down and see what happened to that boy. Parents drowning children? <laughs> Hi, Hexaway. Yeah, serves him right indeed, trying to kick a ball at a cat. Right, what do I do about the splishy splashy? Alright, April, see you later. Ah, okay, so we got the batteries for this boy to fly his plane again. Not plane, helicopter. Okay, now the helicopter is going zoom zoom. Good, yes, scare away the magpie. Excellent. Oh, well, what good was that? Oh. Okay, so that was just to get the cat up over the fence then. And this boy is now all wet through, having collected his ball from a pond, presumably. And now the cat can go over the wall. Chapter 4. Feed the birds. Tuppence a bag. Okay, so now we are in old lady's garden. Come down her tree. We're slinking over. <gasps> Oh, lady, is scary. All right, there's an apple here. Who wants the apple, do we think? This guy? No. 
Can't click on the old lady. Can't click on the man. Don't go anywhere. What do you mean, don't go anywhere? Oh, I can pop that on there. Slink, slink. Ah! There's a peeping Tom. There is a peeping Tom. Alright, this bird's pecking away at this apple. Bird, please. You want to fly up there and eat an apple? I didn't know birds ate apples anyway. Oh. Okay, that's freaky. The gnome can actually move. Oh, there's a worm. Okay, the worm can go up here as well. Bird, you want to go and eat the worm? No? No. Oh, oh, more birds coming. No? Slink, slink, slink! What the hell is up with this lady? What's the matter with you? Not letting the cat cross your... Oh, this rubbish. Oh, red. This is a lot of food for these birds. Oh, there's more birds! Birds eat all fruits? Damn birds! You leave our fruit alone. You eat worms. This bird doesn't seem to want to go up there. Mm. Oh, we've just dropped a bunch of seeds. What can I do with these seeds? I can't pick them up. Ah, okay, it attracts more birds. Finally, okay, this bird wanted the seeds. Alright, anybody else I can- what the hell is this? Is this something else for you to eat? Oh my god, it is. Okay, so I guess now more birds are gonna fly down? Yep. Okay, is this now enough birds on here that you're all fascinated and therefore will allow me to cross the garden? I say me, I mean Milo. Nope. You old bitch! Let the cat through! What is that? Oh, there is a thing. Hi, Katani, how you doing? You can pick a sunflower. Apparently not, but um, I'm missing a couple of birds here. I'm missing these two. So this eats some kind of twig thing and this eats like a snail shell. Can't pick the sunflower, no. Okay, where can I get those two things? Oh shit, didn't mean to click on him. Sorry, cat. Upper right wind. Oh yeah, there's a thing. Uh, what can I water? This? Ah, that's supposed to be a water bowl for the birds then. Oh, it's a bird bath. Okay. <laughs> bird bath? Okay, and then one more thingy majigs. I gotta get this guy. This brown bird. Is there anything up here that I can click? No. He was just to give us the worm, right? He moved away and then the worm appeared. Bird bath and beyond. Very good, Chandroid. Snails on the post of the feed. Oh, so it is. Well done. This is why it's hide and seek. Okay, there's the final bird. Jose! Hi, Jose. How you doing? There, final bird done. Okay, so now... Oh! The big bird came and scared all the other birds away. And now the old lady is freaked out herself. She's been trying to freak us out, now she's freaked out. But the old man is very happy. Bird watching. Mm, nothing happens when I click on this guy. But now they're all watching him up there so I can sneak across the garden, right? Yeah. Ah! Go, go, run, run! Okay, made it. Squish! This hedge is too thick! Oh my god, cat. 
I will try more further in the garden. More further? What the hell? Cat, please. There is no more further, cat. Chapter 5, A Fishing Trip. Look at the little ducks all in a row. The sitting ducks. <laughs> Simsbrarian! Hi, Simsbrarian. Jose says, I'm always happy when I watch birds, but these days have to be careful. They all look older than they are. Jose, <laughs> do I need to put them for you? <laughs> Is that a tiny puppy? Where is a tiny puppy? Oh, here. Yeah, it's a tiny puppy. It's a cat. It doesn't have to speak proper English. Fine. As long as it speaks proper catish, then. Oh, another dragonfly. Which doesn't do anything. I just click on it and it moves a bit. Alright. Dog. Dog just raises its head. Uh, can I click on the ducks? No. Alright, fisherman. Fisherman just pulls his rod up a bit. So, Milo, do your thing. Oh, there's a frog. Ribbit. Ah, okay. So the cat scatters the ducks. And then this girl looks up. Hello? Oh, she gets bread for the ducks, I guess. One piece of bread? There are five ducks, lady. Two pieces of bread for the five ducks. That's a jogger. Three pieces of bread for the ducks. So it was white bread, then it was brown bread, and now it's burnt bread. Four pieces of bread, or whatever that was. And a bunch of seeds, okay. Oh, he was going over the bridge? Okay, I was too intent on her. Oh, okay, so now she's gone back to part one. Pikachu! Hi, Pikachu! Pika, Pika, Pikachu! What's up, Pikachu? Click on the ducks. Alright, we'll see what happens to this duck. Ah, okay, so I've got to time it. Alright, so she's... There you go. Duck, go. Eat. Damn it! So is she now doing the second one? No, it's still the first one. Okay. Okay, so the duck's got that one. Now she's going to come back with the... Brown bread, which I'm assuming is this guy? No. So who goes to that? Is it this one? Yeah, it looks like it's this one. Now she's doing the black bread. Oh no, she's not. Okay, so she'll just keep doing the same bread until we get it. Oh, well, that's easier then. Oh, he swims too slowly. Alright. Come back, come back, we'll try that again. That, okay, so he's got it. And then the black bread, I'm assuming, is this guy. And then she, tro she throws um, a bunch of white stuff. Oh no, it's this, this stuff. Ah, shit. He's also a slow one. Come back, come back. There we go. And then this is the final one. Yeah, very slow crackers. Okay, so that's all the ducks fed. Very good, thank you lady. You're a nice lady and you shall be rewarded for your generosity to the ducks. You will get to eat crispy duck for dinner this weekend. Alright, cat. Can you know... No. Man? Oh! Okay, fisherman is doing things. Oh, oh. Pull it, pull it, sir. You got yourself an old boot. Woohoo! Success! Uh, he doesn't seem very happy about it. <laughs> he 
You got an old boat? Oh my god, there's a thing come Oh, is that a crawfish? Ah! Oh, poor cat. Can this cat swim? Oh. Dog, you wanna do something about it? I got the cat wet. The cat's swimming, it's fine! Oh my god, there's a massive fish. Click on Milo to make him swim faster. I'm clicking, I'm clicking! Swim faster, Milo! Swim faster! The, the fish is gonna get you, Milo! I'm clicking him, I'm clicking him! Calm down! Oh my god, this lady is just watching him. Like, help him, you know? Throw him something. Get up there, Milo. Hey, he kicked the fish in the face. Eat that! So that. Oh, poor drenched cat. Okay, lady, you're gonna try him? Yeah, she's gonna dry the wet cat. Oh, that's nice. She's just fattening him up. <laughs> Congratulations, you have found a secret. Okay. Secret bird? Oh, didn't know I could click this, but right, these are the different things that the um that the ducks ate. All right, enough titivating of the cat. Oh my god! <laughs> Check out the fur. <laughs> that is a very floofy cat now. You love the art style, maybe? Good. It's cute, huh? Oh, there we go. Now the fur's back to normal, not so floofy. Thanks, lady. Alright, now can you scooch and go talk to the dog, maybe? Oh, Milo's not interested in the dog. Chapter 6, Boogie Time. Great, that's Boogie. Ooh, oh my. Hey, there's another cat up here. Oh, and there's a... What is that? Looks like a gremlin, whatever that is. Sir? Oh, interrupting his playing. It's a butterfly that I can click. It just makes them fly a bit further. Oh, this cat's purring. Mm, okay. Let's go, Milo. Access denied. Oh my god! <laughs> Are there really such high-tech cat flaps these days? Well, like, if it doesn't recognize the cat coming up to it, it goes access denied. Really? Catnip. Ooh, enjoy some catnip. Isn't it just super high-tech cat flap? Oh my god, wow. So Milo ate some catnip and now he can do somersaults. Amazing. Oh, um, nice guy. He's just chucked his empty beer can onto somebody else's conservatory roof. What a treat you are, sir. Okay, our guy is not happy about his music. Hey. Just shout at him. Shut it. Hey, shut it! Really? Wow, okay, I would have expected this guy to turn the volume up higher. I clicked on him to make him do that. So every time I click on him, he turns up the music. Hey, shut it. And this guy comes out to say, hey, shut it. Okay. And every time I click on Milo, he eats the catnip. The mad cat boogie. Ah. <laughs> Look at Milo. <laughs> oh my lord. <laughs> oh, even the white cat's come down. Come and play. Oh. <laughs> 
Ako, oh, Milo! Milo's boogie. Oh! Okay, so this Cupid has shot the collar off the cat. So we can now wear the collar. And then we can get into the house. Access granted. Nice! We've just broken into somebody's house. Chapter 7 Unexpected Help. Oh, just wander into somebody else's house. Cat burglar, exactly. All this dancing made me thirsty. There you go. So drink this other cat's water. Perhaps there are stairs over there and I can go back to the roof. Nice slinking. Oh, oh. Watch out. There is a gremlin. That door is closed. Yes, it is. It's that sphinx cat, right? Is that a cat? It's an inside-out cat. Laser pen. We know cats can't resist the laser pen, right? Okay. So I have to... Ah, okay, so where I click the laser pen follows. So I need to click, like, far, far away this side. Okay, now I got to got to slowly lure the cat over there, I guess. Yep. Okay, got to slowly lure it over here. Turn around, cat! Oh my god, this cat's so dumb. Cat! It's on here! Oh my goodness, you dingbat. Maybe up here? I want him to... I want him to like scooch over there. You think I can now get to the door without the lady seeing? No, I can't. So how do I get this cat to see this laser thing and move? Ah, okay, so it's here. Behind? Will you look behind? Nope, you're too stupid to look behind. How about up here on the cushion? No? Okay, how about up here on the table? Oh my god, this cat's dumb. Cat, please. I mean, I can point it there, but it's no use because the cat has to slowly be lured there, right? Oh, okay. Apparently I can drop the key there. So now if I point it here, the cat will go here and like scramble over the... um. Hang on. I'm going to make the cat scramble over the... the... The litter. Wait, how did I make the cat go there? What the hell? Cat, please. Will he follow the ball? Yes, he will follow the ball. Okay. Okay, now back in here. Are you gonna... That's it. Okay, now we can see the key. That key's not for there. What the hell is this key for then? Can y'all see anywhere else this key could fit? Oh, here! I've just seen this keyhole. Okay, so now we need the cat to go... Oh, it's too far away for the cat. The cat's as blind as I am. Get your button here, cat. Okay, now here. Okay, now here? Oh no, what's up here? Cat cup flower thing. Cat photo, Beethoven. Um, clock thing, picture thing, feather, question mark. So what goes here? I don't know. What's next in this sequence?
Uh, where does the cat want to go now? It wants to go... Can you go up here? No, it's still too dumb to go up there. I want you to come here! So that I can sneak out the back door. Yeah, it could be another ball to be symmetrical. I can put I can put the laser dot thing up here, which makes me think the cat is supposed to go up. Ah, okay. So then onto here. Okay. Now can I get out? No. Oh, where do I? Cat can't see back there. So where does the cat go now? Here? And I can click here, which makes me think that it's supposed to be on this side. Oh, I can click on this. No, cat too stupid to look up there. Uh, how about here? Nope, cat too stupid to look here too. Why does she look over there when I click here? You think the shelf says where to click? Okay, so the cup... The ball first we did, and then the cup we did, and then the vase of flowers? The vase of flowers and then the cat picture. The vase of flowers, which is where? Do you think it was just this? And then the cat picture. Flowers was the pillow. Okay, so come back to the pillow. Okay, he won't come back to the pillow. So it was cup and then the f the pillow. So cup, pillow, and then cat picture. Okay. How do I get him away from there? Okay, so start from the ball. Then the cup. Then the cushion. Then the cat picture. Nope, not the cat picture. This cat picture? I can't click on this one. Yeah, so after the flowers is supposed to be the white cat and then the Beethoven bust. Need to turn off the light, okay. So then, back to here, or back to up here, no, so back to the ball, and then the cup, and then the flowers, and then the cat. And then the Beethoven. And then the clock. And then... what the hell is this? The clock and then the sunset and the feather. Is this the sunset? And then the feather being the bird. I'm clicking on the bird. That's not the feather? God, this cat is dumb. <laughs> so, okay. It's this greenish feather and then something. So, I'm clicking on this guy thinking this is the greenish feather, but apparently not. Oh, there's a thing here. Something is shining here. Oh, there we go.
Uh-oh. The lady's mad. She's mad. Um. Okay, so the feather and then the question mark. You can't click the bird. There's no there's no hand on it. I'm clicking, nothing's happening. I'm clicking on the cat. And that's all she's doing. She's like aiming the laser thing at the at the cat. Yes, door handle now. So that this cat opens the door. Beep. Oh. Pianist man is back. Yes, sir? Nothing? Okay, now can I get up? Go, 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 go! Sli Look, they're already watching you. <laughs> There's no point slinking. <laughs> Bye, he says. Good job, peeps! Oh, oh, he's chasing us upstairs. Oh. Oh, he got chucked up. Ow. Poor Milo. Go on. Hey. Chantal? Chantal? Oh, that was cute. Chantal? Chapter 8, The New Neighbors. Ah, okay. So it's the hooligan lot. What's clickable here? This is clickable. Oh, YXMP. Okay, YXMP and it's another one of these code things. Dog. What up, dog? Is this the same dog that was by the riverside? Oh, we can click on the clothes. Oh, okay, we can rearrange these. Oh my lord. His ears are weird. Is there anything else I can click? Click on him. He just looks up. Click on her and she just changes the TV channel. Okay, so we have the blue dress with the yellow flowers. We have the white shirt. We have the red thing. And then the black. And then the bumblebee. Yellow and black. So this and this, and then the red. And then the black. And then the bumblebee. That drops this. Dog goes over. Has a sniff. Pee on it? Woof? Just woof? Okay, so it's whilst the dog is there that I can get off the shed, maybe? No? No. Hmm. It's nothing to do with this tree. What does this guy do other than look up? Nothing? Oh, I can open this. Or at least I can sniff at it. Oh. I kill you. Oh, okay. There's a random dude in there. Okay, so what was this thing? YXMP. anything likely to be YXMP around here? You think when we sniff the clothing, the garbage bag shakes on the bottom left? Really? Oh yeah, it does. But there's nothing to click.
this guy's I'm looking at this guy. And this guy seems to be following my mouse. Look, I move my mouse to the right, he's looking to the right. Oh, maybe not. Maybe he's just Oh he is. Let me see if I can click on this dude whilst he pops out. I kill you. Nope. Nope. Okay, I don't know. Bottle next to the guy. Was there a bottle next to him? Oh yeah! Good eye. Now then, where does this go? Can I give this to you? Yes, you're quite happy to have it. Just, you know, a levitating bottle. Of unknown origin. Containing an unknown liquid. Ugh, it's warm. Wow. Hooligan. Littering in your own garden. Oh, now the dog will drink the beer? And keel over? No? No drunk doggo. But maybe he'll pee on the clothes? I'm still harboring a hope that he'll pee on that and then the lady will be like, What the hell? And when she runs out here, we can go in. But no. Oh, we can take this. Can we stab you with it? <laughs> no. Can we stab you with it? No. Uh, oh, now we can open this thing, right? There we go. So there was something in here. And it is a mouse. I'm not shanking the dog. I'm ripping the plastic bag. The garbage bag. There is a mouse. Get it, dog. Get it. That's a rat. Rat, mouse, same thing, rodent. Okay, so now the dog is not looking. Okay, cat, now's your- Oh, I was gonna say, now's your chance. Oh. Wasn't there another thing behind it? No, there wasn't. That's fine. Famous piano player Yen Kotlont open house concert on July 6th. Okay, so that's the the guy from next door, right? This is the bloody neighbors, the hooligan neighbors whose garden we're in. Yvonne, Xander, Marjolaine, and Peter hoping for a second chance. The Stickle Meyer family is settling nicely in their new home. The family moved house after multiple disputes with the locals in their previous neighborhood. The complaints ranged from weird smells to lots of noise from the family dog, Yope, who was described to bark at everything around the yard. Missing cat, named Milo, grey-coloured. Painter Yanko Rommelcott exhibits in Town Hall. Nice! Hmm? What's that for? This is just in case we can't read this. It pops up the text for us. That's a missing photo, yes. Um, so what were those letters? Why... Why XMP, right? So it's these guys, Yvonne, Xander, Marjolaine, and Peter. Why XMP? Or what numbers do we assign to them? What do you think? What numbers do we assign to them? This is Yvonne, Xander, Marjolaine, Peter. I think it's the order and the colour photo. 
Okay, Yvonne and Xander are the kids, presumably. Marjolaine and Peter are the parents. So Yvonne is four. Xander is three. Marjolaine is one and Peter is two. Four, three, one, two, you think? Can you click the picture to enlarge? No, it just it just gives you the text. This text from here is just for some reason. I'm zooming in on it like this. Number of letters in their names? Okay, so let's try it both ways. First we said what was it? Four three one two. Each object the dog barks at belongs to one of the persons. Oh really? Okay. Okay, so it's not that. Um, so yeah, you said each object the, the dog barks at belongs to one of them. I think you're right. Okay, so one for this dress which belongs to Marjolaine. So Marjolaine is a one. Let me just go back to zero. Okay, so Marjolaine is a one. Yes, that's fine. Okay. Uh, and then when this fella comes out, five. Hey, kill you. Okay, five for Xander. Okay. And then Yvonne. We haven't had Yvonne yet, right? Hey, the guy's gone! I just noticed Peter's gone. One, two, three. So three for Peter. The rat is for the girl. Seven. Seven, because that's her, yeah, it's her um, pet mouse, right? It looks like a, a white mouse! So she's seven for Yvonne. Okay, good job, good job. Oh, is this the remote control for the TV? Oh no, it's for the awning! Bang! So now Milo can get across? Look at him walking so sedately. Oh, oh. Whoops! Yeah, Milo doesn't care. Get it, Milo, get it! The heck? Aren't cats supposed to chase rats? Cats aren't that heavy? No, but it's just a very dodgy piece of awning. Chapter 9, The Final Storm. Okay, we are now high up in a tree. It's an annoying bird. Get it! Perhaps I can jump to my house at the end of this branch. Oh, come on, Milo! These birds are protecting their nest. Get the damn bird! You pecked your nose! Ooh. Oh, this is Yvonne. Hello. Diary. Okay, so we need a, a key for this diary. Hello, Yvonne. So we can open this. There's a bunch of like, birds in this painting. Can we do anything here? I can click on this mirror, but nothing happens when I click on it. I can't click on the faucet. Strange. Can I do anything here while she's gone? No. Oh, I can click on this plant, but nothing happens to it. Oh, okay, I can get the rat. Ah! There is a key. 
um, to open her diary. Do we really want to read her diary? You love the painting? This painting? 25th of June. So we arrived in our new house. I really do like it here. I think it's a better neighbourhood. And I got my own room now. Let's hope this time my family doesn't get in trouble again. But my brother already used the shed to grow oregano. He is such a moron sometimes. I mean, he just doesn't learn. And my father doesn't appreciate the panoramic... No. The piano music of our new neighbour, to say least. He tries to remain kind, though, which is kind of fun to see. Am I reading it right? Is that kind? It looks like K-I-M-D, but there's no such word. He tries to remain... I think it's kind. 26th of June. Today, suddenly, a magpie entered my room. The bird was totally fascinated by one of my piercings lying on the table. I think he liked the glass, so I let him take it. I wanted a new one anyway. He flew away with it to its nest. I saw him loose it there. He probably didn't know what to do with it. For the rest, everything is quite boring here. I wish something unexpected would happen. Oh, I should have just read it here. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I think he liked the glass. Let him take it onto a new one anyway. Blah, 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 so I'm lose it there. Didn't know what to do with it. But I'm just blah, blah, blah. Okay, so what was it this thing said? Uh, yeah, he tries to remain kind, which is kind of fun to see. Okay. Oops. What the hell was that for? What did that teach us? Nothing? The shinies are in the nest. We know there is. But, go away. Magpies will line their nests with all kinds of shiny things, right? That's why magpies are known to be attracted to shiny things. But we can't seem to get any closer because this guy's here. So we need to get like a shiny thing to make this guy fly away so that we can approach the nest. I, th I imagine. There's nothing else I can click here. See whether any more of these will move. I'm intrigued. No, this, these two branches will move. I'm trying to see whether they can be like pulled away, but apparently not. Okay. I can click on this again. I can't turn a page or anything. It's just these two pages that we can read. There is nothing here that's clickable. What do you guys see? Do you guys see black birds or white cats in this picture? No, there's nothing else that I can click here. Faifu! Faifu is here. Hi, Faifu. I like this piano piece. I wonder if the girl left any shinies in the sink. Doesn't look like it. Non non non. Yeah, I mean you're supposed to see both, but you know, when you first look at it, what's the main thing that catches your eye? Okay, now it's pushed up this ring. Now you've got a bloody shiny ring. Oh, so when you call, aha, 
you dropped your shiny thing, which means you flew down to get it. And now the mama bird has come down. And so now your chicks are left unprotected. Alright, so is there an order that we have to get these guys to do things? Okay, so this is one, this is two. Were you three? Yep. And then four was, was it you? Yep, and then you were five. Okay. And then... What happens? So what if they want two, three, four, five? One, four, two, five, three. Yeah, no, I saw that. I've sorted them out, but I don't know what the point of sorting them out was. Serious puppy! Hi, serious puppy. How are you doing? You want to click on them again? a roof tile wiggling? Where? Left or right? Oh! See, I saw it, I saw it. Okay, so now there is a thing. Aha! There is a- Ooh! Congratulations, you have found a secret! Nice one! That is a freaky ass looking bat! His head's like 180 degrees! Bottom of right window? It's slow? Oh, you mean this window? Yeah. That one, right? Or was there another one? guy and he nods. Oh wait, not anymore. Oh, that was weird. Okay, I don't know why all of a sudden he would fly. It's a point and click adventure is, is known as Serious Puppy. Oh. oh, okay, the big bird has come to eat the little bird. Excellent. Okay, that's got rid of the mama bird. What do you mean, no? It's a good thing! We're trying to get this cat home! Oh shit, not as more birds! <laughs> Poor little bird. It's okay, Milo to the rescue. Rah! Oh my god, we're going for a flight. Ow! No, it's fine. I mean, it's a cat, you know? He'll always land on his feet. It's fine. That was close. I guess I have nine lives after all. But now I'm stuck in this tree. How will I ever get home now? I did save the life of that little bird. You did. Because you're a good cat. Is that all you can say, really? Are they going to lift him up? Oh my god, they're going to carry the cat home. They're going to carry the cat home. <laughs> Meow and wait for someone to help. No, no, the birds are gonna fly you home. It's fine. Oh, and what's her name is watching? Yvonne. Yes, what the? Very what the? Oh, I guess Milo belongs to this little girl? Okay, don't worry, little girl. The magpies are delivering Milo back home to you, okay? It's all fine. Now, she's happy because she got Milo back. And that's your garden, which I gotta say is much better than all the other gardens we've gone through. At this point, it was all realistic, but now... <laughs> two for joy! Two for joy! Exactly! Two for joy. There you go! 
know, and that's all the game was. That was a treat of a game. Oh, I'm glad you liked it. That was so cute. Yay. Floating keys and such. I'm I'm most intrigued by the floating bottle of beer, the warm beer that just miraculously floated up to Peter in the upstairs window, and he's quite happy to take it and drink it. This is really nice music and a fun story. Yeah, that was cute indeed. Hi, Kay. Thank you for bringing Milo home. Did you find all the secrets? No, we didn't. Plenty of secrets, but I didn't even know we were supposed to look for secrets. Oh, look at that. We're supposed to find nine secrets, and we only found these two. play again, can we find these secrets, do you think? There are nine chapters to this game, right? So there's obviously a secret in each level. 